turn so you can actually see the fitting. Come around to this side so you're looking in that direction. Very cool. All right, go ahead and start. Yeah. So what we have here is a swedge lock instrument compression fitting that is being used to uh, join a plastic tube with this tube connector supplying compressed air to a valve actuator. And what we have here is I've taken the nut off of the fitting. So if I remove the force of my hand, we actually have air coming out the end of the tube. The reason I'm doing this is I want to show you how good of a seal that the, uh, is created between the ferrule, the tapered ferrule, and the fitting, even when I don't have the force of the nut put on there. Just by holding that tube in place, I'm making a pressure tight seal. So this nut and these threads do not seal in the same way that pipe threads seal. These are not tapered threads, they're straight cut. They perform no sealing function. The only thing the nut does is it exerts a force on the end of the tube holding that tapered ferrule tight into the tapered receptacle of the tube connector. That's all it takes to make a pressure tight seal. And that's how an instrument tube fitting is supposed to work.